everyone. Welcome back. Uh, Winterfell Camp. It's still Monday. We're still dealing with the tornado watch and warnings and storms and everything. But now I got other news. I got a call from the the, the bus, uh, you know, the, the, the tow truck company, UD Pro. Um, the guy, the driver that's doing it, he uh, just called and he, first he wanted to know if he could be here for 7.30 in the morning. No problem. Uh, he was going to leave there at 5, but now he wants to come tonight. So no problem. I uh, just uh, just gave him all the directions. So he's going to be here. I don't know. I'd say around eight o'clock. I would say because I warned him. I said, you know, you've got some pretty crappy weather. And of course, where he's coming from is exactly where the tornadoes were headed earlier. <sighs> Anyways, that's fine. I mean, if he wants to do it, I warned him. Uh, I just was just asking True. Uh, I, uh, because it's all wet in the laneway and everything, so I, I mean, I wasn't prepared to have him today, but I will, you know, roll with the punches, as it were, kind of deal. I mean, you have to roll with punches. So anyways, um, yeah, so he's, uh, he's headed here now. So it's Monday, like I said, so in the middle of all this, uh, the bus is being delivered. Say the V, eh? So that's all right. Uh, we swing with the punches. Uh, I'm going to find out. I'm pretty sure what I'm going to do is I'll have him back it straight in. Uh, and then I'll put the pickup truck in front of it because I don't want to get locked in here. But I'm pretty sure I should be able to move the bus, like if I want to move it around kind of thing. Um, I'm just asking True how we, you know, making sure we can do that. Otherwise, I'll have to have him put it sideways. And I really don't want to make the guy do that with the way the, the laneway is right now. So I'll have to figure out something. Even if worse got to worse, I'd have to call a local tow truck. I know a guy at that Kitley. He's still going to charge me 50 or 60 bucks just to move it around. But that's okay. I think just get this guy out of here. Get him back home. He's driving all the way from Montreal during storms and all the rest of it. So I'm not going to, you know... I'm not going to be too picky about where he's got to put it. So, um, yeah, that's about it. So the bus is on its way here. I've got a guy that uh, is, uh, I'm going to say, about 60 to 70% serious about looking at, and he doesn't live too far from here. So he's not, not a neighbor, but almost a neighbor. He's just up in Mountain Grove. So that's not far from here. So uh, I was just there yesterday, Saturday doing flyers and up around the lakes around there so uh hopefully uh, him and i can come to some kind of deal and get this whole thing uh done with so and then of course uh you know it's still early in enough summer for him you know because i mean i'm sure he's going to want to use the bus so i mean if he has to do any work on the motor or whatever well, he's going to have to do work on the motor but uh, i mean if he buys it the way it is um so all right well there you go so there's news on the bus i didn't expect to be giving you guys today i thought well tomorrow uh, i'll have news you know i'll try and film uh, the guy coming in with the bus and all the rest of it but here we are so okay we'll see each other soon please like share and subscribe if you want to donate to the cause or anything like that there's links down in the description uh we just went up to about 365 we're getting like a new person almost every day so now if I can just get you guys to comment more, that would be kind of interesting because it's, you know, it's kind of one way. I'm always doing the videos, but like I'm trying to get back. So Diana, yay, thank you for hearing from me. And I agree with everything you say, Diana, of course. And uh, I did the same with my family. This is why I'm all by myself in this country. So uh, that's an explanation. Uh, maybe we could sit and I don't know if you do that or not, but when I get over in BC, it pop for a visit, I'll explain to you what I ended up having to do. So very similar to what you did, Diana. <laughs> oh, I know what you're talking about. So, and uh, well, Digger, the bus. There you go, brother. And uh, Danielle, you sent a message the other day. I still haven't answered it, but I'm on it. And I haven't forgotten, by the way. Thank you, brother. You know what I'm talking about, right? Okay, see you later. We'll have storm updates if there's any more storms.